Hello everyone, welcome to Dart Tutorial. In this video, you will learn about scope in Dart. Let me share my screen and let's see a practical demo. Okay, here you can see scope in Dart. First of all, let's learn little theoretical knowledge. Okay, here you can see the scope is a concept that refers to where values can be accessed or referenced. Dart uses curly bracket to determine the scope of variable. If you define a variable inside curly bracket, you can't use it outside of the curly bracket. I will uh, show you a practical demo. First of all, let me open VS Code. And here you can see one file scope.dat. Let me write a main method here. And I will create a variable called my name. And I will store my name here. Okay, Vishwaraj Paudel. And if I want to print my name okay okay if i run this program here you can see vishwaraj powdel got printed okay let me go outside of this main method and i will create another method where print info and i will print the print the my name i will use my name variable here and if i close curly bracket then this is not possible okay here you can see the getter not found that is my name my name is not found in line number seven but we are already declaring uh, my name at line number two because this this is due to the scope the scope for my name here you can see scope the scope for my name is till this line number four okay this line number five or this closing bracket you can't you can use this my name inside this curly bracket okay but not outside of this curly bracket if you want to use this inside or outside curly bracket then you can declare it in global scope just cut it and go outside of main method and you can declare it and you can use it anywhere this is called global scope and this is called local scope also here is one important thing that is uh, lexical scope that is lexically scope language which means you can find the scope of variable with the help of bracket i hope you understood this one if you have any question regarding scope then comment down below i will uh, reply that comment and help you thank you so much for watching this video if you like this video hit the like button if you have any question then comment down below I will see you in the next video. Thank you.